And the drop in temperature is a major concern among advocates for those experiencing homelessness in Maine. Volunteers in Portland are doing what they can to help people prepare. News of Maine's Sean Stackhouse explains why they're worried it won't be enough. A garage in Scarborough stocked full of portable heaters, propane tanks, and supplies to keep those experiencing homelessness warm. Danny Laliberti loading up her car to deliver them to those in need. Every day we're seeing people come into our community space with really bad um, frostbite on their hands and feet. We're giving out tents and sleeping bags nonstop all day long. La Liberty is part of the coalition Hustlin' for the Unhoused, a group of outreach workers and those on the ground working with those experiencing homelessness from several of the support services in the city. Advocates say with the cold on the way and an estimated 200 people sleeping outside, a low barrier emergency shelter is needed immediately. I think it's a basic human need for people to have a place to stay warm and a place to go to the bathroom at night. The city of Portland's new homeless services center is slated to open in March and will have more than 50 additional beds compared to the Oxford Street shelter. However, advocates say something else is needed sooner. This isn't something that needs to be done in two weeks. It's something that needs to be done tonight. Right now, the city of Portland says it's sheltering on average more than 900 people per night through hotels and its shelters. And opening up an additional emergency shelter just isn't feasible. As a city, we don't have the capacity to open another space. Portland's Health and Human Services Director Kristen Dow says, however, Maine Housing is accepting applications for funding for community partners to establish emergency shelters. I'm hopeful that some community partners and, and faith-based uh, organizations will be able to apply for this needed funding. Uh, that we've been asking the state for it for a while. Advocates say with the cold blast just days away, there's no time to waste. People are going to start dying. People are already dying on the streets and we need a shelter today. In Portland, Sean Stackhouse, News Center, Maine.